Broadway is one of the most active streets in all of Seattle, but until recently, it was not very friendly for people on bikes. Before, biking on Broadway meant sharing the lane with cars, some passing on the left, some opening car doors on the right. But now the city and sound transit have installed protected bike lanes. Part of the First Hill Streetcar Project, the new bike lanes give people a safe place to ride, protected from traffic, but also a place to ride where their wheels will not get stuck in the streetcar tracks. Bike crashes have been a big problem in the city's other streetcar project in the South Lake Union neighborhood. Here we're headed south on Broadway as we approach the start of the new bike lanes. We'll wait in this new turning box until the light turns green so we can cross the street safely. Directly ahead you see the site of the future Capitol Hill light rail station and also a potential connection to a future neighborhood greenway on Denny Way. Some sections of the bikeway will be protected by a line of parked cars. Other sections are protected by a cement curb. The bikeway is separate from both the sidewalk and the rest of the street. New transit islands give streetcars and buses a place to stop without pulling across the bike lanes. They also give people waiting for transit a place to stop that's not on the sidewalk. As of October 2013, the cycle track runs only as far south as Union Street, but construction is underway to extend it all the way to Gessler Way. There's still some finishing touches left to be made, and some people are a little confused about how the bikeway works. The people in these two cars are waiting to turn right, but that's actually a parking lane. The city is still working to add more signage to make it more clear how to use this new street. Hopefully Broadway becomes the new model for what a complete street in Seattle looks like.